yeah, um, so, yeah, um, hi, it's, uh, it's been a while since I haven't made uh, a video where I show my face often, and, um, yeah, it's probably because I'm not, I don't feel like showing my face as much as I normally do when, you know, making videos or, uh, just do some, do something. Because uh, I don't really find uh, posting videos as as often because it's not something that I would take it seriously for uh, for such a long period of time. Um, but the reason why I'm making this video is because uh, I, there's a lot going on in my mind right now and. It's hard for me to express without having anybody to talk to, or anybody to just listen to what I want to say. And what better way to, uh, so like, what better way to to do that than to make a video about it? So, uh, yeah, yeah, I, I can't. I'm always really embarrassing. I'm so like, I constantly get embarrassed or I all I constantly or easily get embarrassed just by um, just by talking to other people and not, not just because um, not just because I, I'm afraid of people judge me for what I'm, uh, what I'm going to say it's probably because like, I don't know how can I speak clearly in these kind of circumstances where you can just you know I'm free to just say whatever I want. Uh, I'm very careful what I try, and, what I want to say, and it's hard for me to like uh, to just keep saying it without having to screw things up. So yeah, there's there are times where I stutter a lot, and I try to I, I try to uh, learn from those mistakes and just try to make try to improve it. Where you know where the stutter will just uh, fade away, things uh, so so on, and I, yeah, sometimes yeah, sometimes I, I the stutterness just tends to to fade up fade out uh, in some in some cases, and it is really a good improvement for me where I I'm starting to speak uh, English fluently as much as often as I. I used to. Um, uh, so yeah, like, like Eng English is a really good subject. Uh, <laughs> okay. All right, cut that. Out. Um, so yeah, like, I want the reason why I'm making this video because I want to talk about uh, what I've been doing through these past. Few like the reason why I'm making this video is because I want to talk about what what's keeping me busy throughout those years. Like since uh, oh my god, when's the last time I ever made a video where I show my face or I make the reaction videos? Um, it all started back in 2018 and 2019, early 2019. Uh, yeah, <laughs> that was really that has been a very very long time ago and <laughs> yeah yeah I don't think that those those videos made uh, have ever made an impact to this channel but uh, you know it's it's good to have some history of history of me uh, every now and then and it's kind of it's kind of fascinating because I always tend to find it weird that people tend to rec uh, to record my every movement like uh, like people archiving my stuff, my life, my personal life, and at times, uh, at first it was really weird, but at the same time it's really fascinating because, you know, you ten you can look back to it and you see that, and you see to yourself that, oh, oh my God, <laughs> that really did happen. You can actually look back to it, and it's, and to you it it doesn't, and when you think about it, that oh my God, this is not. If you think about it, it feels like, oh my god, 
you know that feeling where you look back to something to your like your memories it feels like oh so i used to have a memory like that before oh so that happened before and that's the feeling where i i tend to have like oh my god i never knew that i used to do that kind of stuff and it just and it's all coming back to me that it's it's just amazing that i i i used to do stuff like that and uh, comparing my past self and now, it's it's more of a big step up for me. Like I'm pr I'm improving every second of the day. I'm improving every year or so. But there there are about there are a lot of changes for me throughout the years. And yeah, I I really want to archive myself as much as possible, or record as much memories as I can make, so that you know. Uh, if I ever get older, I can always just look back to this, like like this video, and tell to my future self that oh my, and my future self will be all like oh my god, this is this is really this is really a moment that I, I that I used to be this kind of guy, and yeah, it, it is something that I I found it really really flattering, really uh, fascinating. So, yeah, I, I, I will be doing these kinds of stuff where I, I would just, you know, record as much uh, memor memories that I, can, that I can record or I can archive, but, you know, sometimes, sometimes these, uh, these videos that I'm making uh, don't usually happen every now and then, and sometimes, sometimes it tends to never happen due to many circumstances and yeah given by the circumstances that I'm, do, that I'm having right now are not are really just the usual stuff where like I've the kind of stuff where I'm just uh, that has already been a problem to me ever since when I was born and it keeps happening and it always happens up until now uh, I really don't want to mention those kind of stuff because it's not something that's you know worth uh, mentioning. But I would I would uh, I would want to mention about the stuff that I've been doing in my past years. Uh, so back when back in 2019, I go to, I got to college. Uh, it was in the BUP Binion campus, and. Yeah, that was a good experience to have. I only, I only have like a good, ex a good physical experience, just like in one year, a, one year of a good experience, a good school, college experience. It was pretty much good enough for me because uh, I don't, you know, I don't want to get overwhelmed, too overwhelmed for it. Like, sorry, I don't want to get overwhelmed for it just by doing so, but. You know, it's it's sometimes it's like a, it's an experience where you know you just have to see it for yourself, and you know it's like a journey where you had to yeah you, know, you have to walk it on yourself. I don't know how I don't know if that makes sense, but yeah, I think you get the idea. And ever since like the, uh, the pandemic happened uh, back in 2020 and 2021, yeah, yeah. That, that's that those are the years where the that usually happens so yeah back in 2020 like I was already in the second year uh, you know those are really really a big change for me where I need to adjust as much as possible like I had to like buy equipment for a computer uh, I save a lot of money for a computer and I build it for myself uh, I feel really, I it it feels really rewarding that you know I I made some I made a PC by myself because I don't usually do this. Uh, I never built a PC before when uh, I never built a PC before ever since I've gone to this I gone to my course in my college years. So oh sorry. And then the next one, I, I never, I haven't, 
Like, I haven't built a PC ever since I was in the first year of college because th that's the only year that I was able to learn stuff uh, when it comes to computer to computer building. Like, because uh, I, I took computer engineering, and it's really it is a really good experience for um. So this, these are really important stuff that you need to that you need to ta that you need to learn on a daily basis because you know it's kind of uh, it's kind of well informative that you will you will be needing these kinds of information to to get things done. Uh, you can you can always just you know Google it, you know, search the web or so, but you know having some having someone to teach you how to make it it's it's a big it's way more different than having a video teaching you how to do so which is you know it's so it's all right it's okay um so as i was saying like the other ones uh the other stuff that i've been doing yeah the other stuff that i've been doing are more on college stuff more on college stuff and uh, personal stuff that I I can't I, I can't bring up too much of it, but uh, most of it are just you know personal stuff that involves me just uh, doing the chores uh, uh, making sure that the house doesn't catch on fire uh, thankfully that, that never happened so not yet but and also yeah, up until now, I, I, I'm still. Yeah, up until now, I'm I'm still in college. Like, um, I'm, just gonna, I'm gonna be enrolling uh, next next week. So yeah, about so overall, the my whole, my experience with this, it, it's really interesting. Like, um, if I want to reflect it through my three years in college I think it's I think it's a really um, a, an interesting path where I get to where I got where I got to meet a lot of interesting people and got to learn a lot of interesting interesting uh, stuff at school that I never usually got to learn back when I was in high school because in high school you can barely know, they barely taught you anything. Um, I'm not saying that you don't you don't you don't learn a lot of stuff. I'm not saying that you, you don't learn anything in high school. I mean I learned a lot of stuff in high school, but not not in the way where college put things in depth like. Um, like sometimes it's like more on certain point or what's the most important stuff. Uh, yeah, that that's pretty much what is the advantage of college, I think, because you know, you know that's the main. It all depends on the course you're gonna be taking. So if you're taking an engineering course, well, that's gonna be more on the math stuff and the science stuff. So so I did actually. So yeah, back when I was senior high, I did took a lot. Of a lot of college-related stuff there that that I tend to be that I've gone that happens to be very familiar to that happens to be very similar to the to the course to the subjects I have been taking back when I was in the first year, and that really helped me. That it really helped me that it really helped me to to get the bigger to get a good idea of what's coming to. Me. For me, uh, that really helps me a lot. So, if so, if I would if I would reflect reflect my three years in college, I say it's you know I say it was okay. Like um, I can I can still keep up as much as I can. I can still understand what the professors are saying and stuff like that. You know, I just tend to like keep doing what I what I usually what I'm good at. You know, just listen to stuff. I don't have any special skills. I, I don't. If I ever had any special skills, I've already been doing some stuff 
be doing some hobbies that I can actually earn money. But uh, as of now, I don't have that kind of that kind of skills that can actually that I can actually make profit to it or anything. It's it's not something that I would want to have. I think it's like something that could be in, could be interesting to to have to like to get a skill that you know not other people can actually do other than me. <laughs> but but anyway, like. So aside for for my personal life, I don't want to I don't want to mention too much about it. But I, I would I would say I, I can I can say tell you this that uh, I am very dependable. I am dependent to my parents. So like um, so I I can only I only, I only follow to them. That's, uh, but uh, but they gave me some form of freedom where like I can go outside as much as I want, given, depending on the time, but, you know, if it's school stuff, and you can get, I can actually go outside for, for that reason, if it's some school stuff, but if it's for my, like, personal fun stuff, I can only go, I can, I can only go so far, I can, I can only go, you know, as far as what they want me to go, just go to like, a, you know how parents do. They don't want you to go as far away. You don't want them. They don't want you to be off their radar. They, they always want to. They always want to keep track on you, always. And you know, fair enough. I mean, like if you're in their territory, they, <laughs> that's that's their concern. Like if you're. You're in their territory, and because you're in your ter you're in their territory, and that's their business. So <laughs> you're fair enough, and you know I, I kind of respect that too because you know it's kind of fair to be to exactly like in real life in, in real life events that like you're you're in someone's territory and that's their business. So they have to deal with it, and they you know. And as of yeah, if I compare it back when I back in 2018 to now 2022, I say that the the big leap of it was like me having to be as open than I usually am because back when I, back when I was a little bit younger, uh, uh, I tend to struggle to be open to, to my feelings or to for my expressions for I because I, I I tend because back then and even up until now I, I always tend to uh, to let out as much expressions that I want to that I want to let to let go because you know keeping these keeping these feelings that I have tends to like um, it tends it tends to be hard to keep, you know, it's something that I really can't seem to to keep it to myself, and I want someone to like listen to what I have to say and what I'm feeling right now, uh, just so I can have someone to to make a uh, to make a respond to you know what they want they want what they want to say or what I just uh, what I, what I just say. So yeah, uh, and also my, my 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 also the other problem that I have uh, being being with my parents is like privacy stuff. Um, my room is okay. I, I think I prefer to be in this room than any other room that that, that they gave me. Um, the only problem here is I don't have any doors, so you know they can barge in as much as they want. circumstances like uh, sometimes I just um, there are times where I change clothes and they just barge in without even knocking but how can they knock because there's no doors and 
that can result to, um, you know, just that. And that's pretty much a little bit of a problem that, uh, I don't, have to, I don't have any privacy here. Like, I got nothing to hide, for, to be honest. And that's pretty much the problem that I'm, I'm having, being with my parents. Um, you know, as of now, I'm I'm not in, I'm not as independent that I should be because you know, I'm 20, I'm 21, I'm gonna be 22 in a few days. Oh yeah, did I mention that that my birthday is in a few days, like two days by now? Because by by the time that I'm by the time that I'm do, uh, I'm finished with this video, this could be you know, posted way before or before or or at the moment in my before or at my at my uh, at my birthday so yeah I guess I guess you could say it's um it's like a it's a moment it's a it's a video where I just you know talked about what what I want to say to myself now that I'm that I'm, I am sorry about that yeah like this is some yes this is like gonna be like a video so, so yeah you can say that this but it's like a video where I I'm talking of that I'm, so yeah this is gonna be like so yeah this like I'm sorry so yeah like this is like gonna be a video where I just talk about what I want to say uh, now that I'm 22 almost and yeah like what do I feel about it um, I don't feel anything I mean like I, I think that being 22 is doesn't really matter because like, I'm, I already went past 18 and uh, being older than 21 is not that big of a deal and you know you know I, I do change a little bit uh, I didn't, I didn't when it come physically I don't change that much uh, maybe a little bit of the facial areas but uh, you know, the face areas maybe it cha that changed a little bit but but for me I don't feel anything that that I can say that I have changed uh, the only way I can that the only way I can uh, realize that is you know by doing stuff outside physically and see what are the changes that's happened that I used to do from now. Um, yeah, as yeah, ever since the pandemic started, I've never gone to, to my to, to, to my college. I've never gone to the to the college building ever. So I really wish I could go back to that to that set. <laughs> To that school and see what what the changes are. And it's you know, I think I'm looking forward for it. Like I, I think there's gonna be like a face there's gonna be like a face to face class in any moment or any time and moment this year. But as of now, I don't think there's ever gonna be maybe in a few months. But as of now, I don't think there's any ever gonna be any face to face. Which is okay. Like uh, I can still. I can I can still keep this keep it like this. So so what I've been so what have I been posting uh, now? Um, basically, I'm just been posting like a, a bunch uh, a bunch of sk video skits, a little bit of memes with it. Uh, I did post some archival recordings of my of my school meetings. I know this is not something that. The school allows you to, but if it's allowed for teachers, it's, it's allowed anyway and for people, for kids to, and for the students to look back to it and just relearn what they just, well, what they, uh, what they learned back in the me the, me the other meetings, so that you know they could look back to it. It's, so there's nothing wrong with it, and. And I also been starting uh, voice. <laughs> I've been practicing. Dude, I've been practicing voice acting. I, 
I do I do know this a little bit. Uh, not kind of my thing, uh, but I really am interested in doing something like that because I haven't. That's not something that I've done uh, back back uh, back then. But I really am looking forward to be learning these kinds of interesting uh, stuff to say that I think this is like another another way for me to find to find like what's yeah I think this is like another way for me to see if if there's any skill that I'm, that I'm ever, ever ever good at like um, like I'm I'm constantly just trying a lot of things and see uh, what are the and I just want to see which which of these stuff that I'm really good at what are the skills that I'm really good at and what are the the types of with the with the thing in the jigs or whatever. It's basically what are the stuff, what are the skills that I'm that I'm actually you know good at. What I think it's you know I find it interesting. What I think it's fun for me. Or what what I think it's what I think it's uh, uh, what I think it's uh, you know something that I can. That I can keep doing it for a very long time, and yeah, I keep yeah. Whenever I think about that, I f it feels a bit you know, <laughs> it feels a bit weird that because I, I when because I don't re usually express these kinds of stuff as often often because I never even have that I never had that in mind where I just. That I will have a skill that that I will be doing as much as for a very long time. It's like a hobby where you just keep doing it until you just get get tired of it. But you know, uh, as of now, I think you know voice acting is very interesting, and I'm looking forward to keep doing it as much as I can. And yeah, like yeah, like. That's pretty much it. That's all I want to tell. Uh, that's pretty much all I want to say, because uh, you know, I'm not much of a talking kind of person. Uh, I usually am the kind of type of guy that just you know want to keep a low profile and just you know see how, how the world goes and just like, live a normal life. You know, I, I I'm not the kind of type of guy that stands out. That you know. Well, I don't want to be like the center of, of attention because I don't think that I can handle it, and I don't think that something that I want to have. I don't want to have kind of that kind of stuff. But anyway, uh, I hope that. So yeah, um, thank you all for listening to what I want to say. Uh, it's been fun for me to you know to make this kind of video where uh, I would. I would just tell you everything what's on my mind right now that that could you know help me help me or help other people to express themselves and make a better person of themselves. I, I don't know. I just can't seem to to make a full sentence when it comes to these kind of kind of stuff, and it's kind of weird that uh, you know, my. I guess you could say that my, my English is bad, I think. So anyway, I think that think that does it, I think. Um, so yeah, I, I, this is gonna be a long, long video. Like, like if it's like an uncut version, this is gonna be so long. So I'm basically gonna be uh, editing some of these out, like, yeah. So yeah, I hope you guys have a, so I, I hope you guys uh, are having well. So yeah, I hope you guys have a wonderful time. Uh, yeah, keep safe. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll see you guys soon, uh, or or not. <laughs> oh, whichever whichever comes first. So yeah, uh, I'll see you guys later then. Bye.
bye